Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. In this lesson, you will learn how to import photos saved to the hard drive of your computer into the organizer of Photoshop Elements. To import photos from your hard drive, open the organizer window and choose File, Get Photos and Videos, From Files and Folders from the menu bar. Alternatively, you can instead click the Import drop-down button at the left end of the shortcuts bar. Then select the From Files and Folders command from the drop-down menu that appears. In the Get Photos and Videos from Files and Folders dialog box, navigate to the folder where you have your images stored. Use this dialog box to navigate to the folder or into the folder where the images are stored depending on what you want to import. This dialog box lets you import all media contained within a selected folder, including the contents in its subfolders. It also allows you to only import selected files within a folder into the organizer if preferred. To import all media files in a folder, use the Get Photos and Videos from Files and Folders dialog box to navigate into the folder that contains the folder with the media you want to import. Then click the folder to select within the dialog box. To also import all media contained within subfolders of the selected folder, ensure that there is a check mark within the Get Photos from Subfolders checkbox at the bottom of this dialog box. To only import photos from the selected folder, uncheck the checkbox instead. To import only selected photos or videos, navigate into the folder that contains the photos or videos you want to import. Then select the images that you want to import into the organizer. To select a range of adjacent photos, click the first image to import, hold down the shift key on your keyboard, and then click the last photo to import. Then release the shift key. To select multiple non-adjacent photos in a folder, click the first photo to select it, hold down the control key if using Windows or the command key if using a Mac, and then click any other photos to select in the folder. Then release the control or command key when you are finished. To set additional importing options for your selection, check any checkboxes you would like to apply at the bottom of this dialog box. You can check the Automatically Fix Red Eyes and Automatically Suggest Photo Stacks checkboxes to apply those settings to the imported media. For photos on removable drives or DVDs, you can check the Copy Files on Import checkbox to import the photos versus linking to them, which is the default behavior. You can check the Generate Previews checkbox to generate and display low-resolution preview copies of those images instead. After you've selected the files or folders to import, click the Get Media button at the bottom of the dialog box to import your selected items into the organizer. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.